Welcome to Las Cruces, New Mexico. The last time the Fresno State football team was here was 2011. Pat Hill was the head coach. Derek Carr was the quarterback. But the Bulldogs lost their only loss ever to the Aggies. They're hoping that won't happen again. We treat uh, every week like it's game week, whether it's a bye or, or we got a, you know, the number one team in the nation. We, you know, our preparation is the same. But the execution is not always the same. Of course, having said that, Josh Hokett was brilliant last Saturday. He scored three of the Bulldogs' five touchdowns in their win over Sacramento State. Man, it was a blessing. Uh, you know, you wait for opportunities like that, and I was just happy that I was able to capitalize on it. I think mentally we're in a good spot right now. We just got to just not get complacent and just really just keep working hard and just really um, locking in on our assignments and just being being go back to playing Bulldog football. Now Fresno State's focus is on New Mexico State two teams that played every year from 2005 through 2011 when they were in the whack together. It may have been eight years since the last matchup, but each team has done its homework this week. They don't really press like that. They're more of a two high, one high, four type team. Uh, I'm looking forward to getting a lot of passes and you know moving the ball down the field. If what the Aggies head coach says is true, Carrick Wheatfall and others should have that opportunity. I think Fresno is probably the best team we have played other than Alabama. Uh, you know, I think looking at them talent wise and uh, the people they have and, and uh, what they're playing with there, they, they've probably got a little bit better personnel than Washington State. So this is going to be another big challenge for us. You know, they've played a very difficult schedule so far. You know, playing Washington State and Alabama and San Diego State, they played a uh, really difficult schedule and then they had a shootout this last week that they just fell a little bit short uh, 55 to 52 but uh, really proved that they can put a lot of points on the board. Yeah they scored 52 in a loss to New Mexico. New Mexico State is 0-4 this season. Fresno State is 1-2. If the Bulldogs are to get to 2-2 it means they'll improve to 18-1 all time against the Aggies. Kickoff tomorrow night is at 5 p.m. our time back in California. This, by the way, the Bulldogs' first trip outside of California this season. In Las Cruces, New Mexico, I'm Andrew Martin for Sports Central.